Did you know that there's a vibrant art scene in downtown Halifax? I'm Kristen Pickett and welcome to Big Day Downtown, the series. I'm down by NASCAD University and I'm going to go find Linda Hutchinson, Director of University Relations, to see what I can find out about it. So Linda, tell us a little bit about NASCAD. NASCAD is the most amazing, fantastic art school in the country. Yeah. It's, uh, we've got a thousand students here. It's been uh, in working in Canada since 1887. It's the oldest art school uh, and uh, all significant art starts here. And what is student life like at NASCAD? Uh, students start their program in foundation year, which is a very broad sort of hands-on to everything. So they're involved in every discipline. Uh, yep. We have everything here from craft, design, uh, fine art, art history, film. Um, there are all kinds of ways that students can appreciate and understand and develop their art in, in many different ways. And Linda, who are some of the great artists who have come out of NASCAD? Well, that's a great question because there are so many successful artists that have come out of NASCAD. One yep. wouldn't dare name one. Um, recently, we have the Sobe Art Award here at the AGNS. We have right. uh, two, two of our grads in that. Um, RBC Foundation, RBC uh, Painting Award. We're also well represented there. Um, great history. Uh, NASCAD artists are found in every gallery and every university and art school uh, in the country and beyond and across the world for that matter. Okay. What about for somebody like me? I'm interested in taking um, a painting class, for example. Is there something sure. for me without Absolute. being an, a student enrolled? Ab absolutely. There's a great uh, school we have, the School of Extended Studies. Mm -hmm. The office is just around the corner. And uh, people can take any kind of course that they want to take in any discipline, uh, any age. We have uh, classes for, for young people, yep. for older people like me. Uh, <laughs> there's lots of ways to, to find some fun here at NASCAD. Oh, sounds like a plan. I can't yeah. wait to check sure. it out. I hope you do. Yeah, yeah, thanks so much for chatting with us. You're so welcome. Look at all this cool stuff. I'm here at Argyle Fine Art and I'm heading in to meet the owner, Adriana Afford. Adriana, how long has Argyle Fine Art been around? Uh, we have been open for about 11 years now. Wow, and yeah. you've had several different locations in the downtown core. What keeps you coming back? We just love the energy of downtown. Um, we, we, we were up on Argyle Street, hence our name. Mm -hmm. um, we moved down on the waterfront and now we're happy to be back up on Barrington Street. Okay. and. You have plenty of beautiful art here. Is there any programs or events that you hold here at the gallery? Well, we always showcase uh, artwork by Atlantic Canadians, a mm -hmm. variety of different styles of art. Um, but we do host a lot of fundraising events and special events throughout the year. And Adriana, what would you tell the novice art buyer? There's lots of different ways to, to buy art. Basically just look around and find what you like okay. and um, come to events, meet people, start to kind of get a sense for that. But we have a lot of things that are really affordable um, and we have a lot of payment plans and stuff. So a lot of people will choose to do that too. Oh, great idea. Yeah. Thanks so much for chatting with us. Thanks. Wow, I feel so inspired to check out some art classes someday soon. But if you want to see some art, Make sure to come downtown. There's almost 20 galleries to choose from.